The police chief says those involved could be arrested and he's looking for video to help identify them and he says he needs the community's help. On Tuesday afternoon, police were seen driving around 6 and Swatera streets, the area the chief says the mini riot occurred. Police say after Friday night's football game, the dispute between teenagers within and outside the district grew to around 100 people. He says at one point it turned towards police. A officer's car window was busted. Very scary, yes. Marilyn Jacobs mm -hmm. lives next to where it all happened. Though she did not see anything, she says someone could have been hurt. Police say this Friday there will be extra security at the game to make sure that doesn't happen. I think that would be a good idea, honestly. Now, the police chief told me, quote, that he will put a stop to this, but I, I only have a 14-man police department, so I need the community's help. Now, the school superintendent shared with me some uh, safety uh, ideas that uh, he has plans to do, but says he will not be talking to the, he will not be talking about that until he talks to the chief. Reporting in Stilton, Portia Johnson, News 8.